Hello everyone, I'm back with another video and in today's video, we're looking at the sandbox uh, Yeah, sandbox <laughs> Okay, so we're going to look at the sandbox uh, for heroes, which is specifically for the resistance Now, of course, before we start, please do give this video a, uh, You know, a thumbs up and or a like and of course subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification to all notification for you to not miss an upload or stream from my channel Okay, now looking at the sandbox version here, everything is maxed out for rank 16. Okay, and we now have our hero right here, which is going to be the Wasp. Okay, so similar to the Cerberus video I made, the class symbolizes like similar to leveling system. I'm not exactly sure for that yet, just yet. Okay, and if you look at the top right hand corner, the gold and the credit icon, just below that you will see uranium. Okay, so you are only required to pay or use up to uranium to unlock the wasp within each battle. Okay, so you only need to use it one time for each battle, okay, for you to, of course, resurrect or, you know, like produce a wasp every single time. Okay, you're not supposed to pay uranium. You only need to pay it once. Okay, now the uranium here, okay, as per some that missed out my video, the uranium is actually used to unlock the heroes for you to be able to use them within or inside a battle. Now, there's actually a maximum of 15 uranium. You can actually go over that. Okay, now, if you have a question regarding the uh, uranium, well, the uranium replenishes itself over time okay and you don't necessarily need to buy gold you know to replenish the uh the uranium but if ever you can't really wait that long or that much you can actually use up gold to replenish your uranium okay so just giving you a heads up on that okay it's not really required for you to use a gold so that you can use the hero okay and going over here we got the uh Prototype factory. Well, as it shows here, prototype factory. Well, this is a prototype for testing. Now, as you guys can see, we have prototype factory 9,191 1, HP and 106 armor, and that's only level 1. Okay, so level 2 and level 3 is still unlocked. Now, for comparison, we're going to do the same thing assault vehicle factory 9,840 HP. And 106 armor, so pretty much the prototype factory level 1 and the assault vehicle factory has the same stats. Now, going back to the wasp, the stats of it will be 4222 HP, armor is 56, second tier, okay, medium armor. The speed is similar to that of a dragonfly. Let's check. Ah, the dragonfly here is okay, there it goes. Rank 17, you will have a 100 speed for the dragonfly but again this is for rank 16 okay okay so um yeah so it has 100 speed who, who knows it might actually be uh faster at higher ranks or so on as you rank up and unlock more upgrades we don't know just yet okay now the cost is 300 the production time is quite uh, fast at 33 seconds the view is somehow Amazing with an 11 view. Okay, and requires three command points. Now, let's go over to the abilities Now as can be seen right here. It can actually fire an acid shell Designated deals damage to all units and buildings within the uh, explosion radius and corrode their armor increasing the damage uh, Affected or inflicted to them by 80% Okay, now as you guys can see here 80% damage for 8.8 .8 seconds is actually a very big deal, alright? And as we guys know, the engagement here in Art of War are almost instantaneous, alright? So 8 seconds is a very, very big factor, okay? And also the recharge time would be 26.8 seconds, meaning that is actually the, uh, the cooldown so that you can use the skill again. Damage versus 1 to infantry is going to be 243 Okay, and damage versus armor 2 is 400, uh, I mean 243 for the infantry and 483 for the second armor, meaning coyotes, etc. 
483. Damage to armor number 3 is going to be 243. Zeus, Jaguars, so on and so forth, and also buildings. Explosion radius is actually amazing as well as to 2.5 cells, okay? Action radius or action range, so you need to be 8.5 cells so that you can actually, you know, use this skill. Now, the duration of the skill as mentioned here is 8.8 .8 seconds. The damage that you will actually, the bonus damage that you can deal with a unit that is affected by this uh, acid burst or by the skill is going to increase by 80%. And that's actually a very big deal. Now, the shield for most part, I'm not exactly sure if I recall it correctly. The shield generator can actually increase or reduce the damage taken by 40 to 60%. We're, I'm not exactly sure about that, okay? But... If in case that this uh, you know this this skill reduces the uh, I mean increases the damage by 80% then that's actually cool right okay now going back here or moving on to mist disguise you can actually see here if wasp or allied units in the radius of 3.16 cells gets damage wasp uses a mist disguise the the disguise that decreases the enemy's firing accuracy by 63 percent at all air units inside the mist disguise okay so apparently it can actually hide uh any any or anything that is in the air okay air units inside its mist now the mist itself does not guarantee no damage at all it simply reduces the the um the projectiles accuracy by 63% so there's still a possibility of you taking damage but it's 63% less okay now the ability uh, recharge time meaning the cooldown is going to be 28.7 seconds alright and radius of action is 3.16 that's actually quite nice okay 3.16 okay it may actually increase over time as you rank up okay duration is 8 seconds Firing accuracy decreases by 63%. Okay. So, now moving on to our weapon. Okay. There it goes. And Sting Capsule Missiles. Alright. Now, the damage to armor 1, to meaning to infantry, is 199 to 49 for second armor. Okay. 199 to third armor. Now, the firing range is actually quite neat. 6.1. It's the first time I ever saw that ha a unit having 6.1 firing range usually it ends up with 6.5 and then 14 and so on and so forth okay now the rate of fire is actually amazing okay actually amazing accuracy is accuracy is not really that bad in stationary or while you are moving okay and the radius itself is 1.12 so that's actually good okay now this wasp can also get or you know lower its altitude of pl flight so that it can get or capture uh, capture flags capture containers and so on okay so this uh here or right here can actually help your troops capture containers or flags for domination maneuvers or capture the flag battles okay now let's move on to the battle okay here goes i'm going with who am i too and of course i'm going to be crabalicious let's go I'm gonna be at the top. Deployment the okay, there it goes. Okay, we're going to ready the emergency boost. Give me orders. Roger, that's why. Resource 
Gathering the containers. So pretty much 50-50 containers on the ground or on the ocean. Okay, we're still gathering here. It's actually more intense in terms of gathering those containers. And those uh, kaimans that we have right there. Okay. Check what he has. Doing HQ three. Okay. Uh, uranium one time so I can use the uh, the wasp the entire battle so even if the uh, wasp got annihilated I can simply reproduce it without the cost of any uranium because the usage of uranium in battle is only one time okay here it goes Oh man, this is bad.
Okay, let's have Wasp instead. Okay, we're gonna have to try and be annoying right there. Their supply center first. Okay, we're gonna have to try and be annoying here. Vertex already out. Place the building. Insufficient energy. Okay, we're gonna have to retreat. Guns loaded. Off we go. Insufficient energy. Place the building. Insufficient energy. Give me a firing solution. Okay. we produce Zeus now he has no special vehicle factory so there's there will be no typhoons Protect the hero since, of course, Wasp is very squishy versus those, uh, those, um, vertex additional anti air, and of course, another Place vehicle fact or special vehicle factory. Let's have this one destroyed, place it right here. That would be super awesome if it was able or I was able to place it there, okay. Gonna have to get rid of some scouts. Okay. Then wait it out. Okay. Go back. Okay. Oh wow, it's actually a good micro right there. Ah, I'm going to destroy it. Okay, it's actually not bad for a special vehicle factory and two vertex. Vertex are more expensive. Okay, let's have more hawks. He already has a. Uh, already has what do you call it? It's like a vertex now. We're going to have to try and defend since the confederation is going to attack us. Okay, 
build up the number of ground army. Since, of course, as we all know, uh, Zeus are already stronger than the Jaguars. Okay, it seems like this is an all in. Ear, okay. He has anti ear, and then we're going HQ four. Oh, what was that? Okay, for it to uh, porcupine missiles did not hit, of course, that's pretty much normal. Okay, we're going HQ4 slowly but surely this time. Okay. to recover some of the HP of those Hawks. Let's have more Hawks. Okay, let's have a scout right here. Press to see if there will be any pending attack of Vertex from the side. Okay, I'll have a four. Four porcupines right there. There it goes. Grading that to level two, so once the HQ4 is finished, we're going for Chameleon, of course. Okay, I built a sniper tower here to somehow have more view around the surrounding area. Oh, wow, barely made that alive. See what's gonna happen here. Okay, we're taking the uh, high ground vision. With the help of Wasp, it was possible to lower down the armor of those Zeus. 
Okay, now we're going to ransack those typhoons. And we're going for an A raid boost. Nice to take over here. Oh wow. Oh man. Okay, shield generator. Okay, one uh one Jaguar down. Ah Oh nice. Managed to land a hit. Okay, back. Okay, go back, go back. Okay, go for a recovery boost to recover the HP of the wasp. Okay, we're going to block the chameleon's uh, click point right there by press <laughs> by having the uh, wasp go above it so it will be harder to target the chameleon by default ah man that's expected of Fox Okay, we're going in now. Okay, there's like an energy shield right there. Okay, so the wasp actually threw the uh, the acid bomb, and then, of course, my jaguars can like uh, attack the units that are actually weakened. Oh wow! Okay, we're gonna have to retreat. Okay, we need at least a porcupine right here. Oh my god. Okay, there it goes. Nice. Oh no! No 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 no! You have to live! You have to live! Nice! It lived to see another day. Okay, we're going to activate this fog right here. Okay. 
you see acid bomb on that okay we're going to deny the Cerberus oh man destroyed Okay, are there any more anti-air right here? There goes. Okay, well, I think that's it. No, I'm going to talk about the wasp's uh, capability in terms of surviving. You know, I mean, if there's like vertex around and type, you know, several typhoons, <laughs> if you had your wasp throw an acid grenade, it's pretty much like 70% dead, and then 30% you live, and then the vertex will somehow finish it off. That's how it is. Uh, in my opinion, based on this uh, battle, I uh, did like several battles now, okay, but yeah, so, well, yeah, <laughs> okay, now if you liked the video, please do give this video a thumbs up, again, of course, that's gonna be like the wasp right there, look at that boy right there, okay, and it can like fire on the move, okay, facing the target all the time, regardless of the direction where you're headed, that's actually nice, I like that feature. Okay, and throwing the acid bomb is actually good. Yes, it deals a ton of damage, but the thing is um, You know if there are like Typhoons and vertex. Yeah, it can actually escape the typhoon due to its mist However, the vertex will definitely finish it off after the mist already ran out Which is always going to be the case in real PvP battles. So yeah Okay, well, of course do you comment down below what are your thoughts into this video and of course don't forget to subscribe like and turn on the notification to not miss a hero update or videos or stream from my channel likewise thanks for watching have a great day and good luck with your battles bye now